So big, big breakthrough in breathing exercises that people with sleep apnea have been reporting, want to share it with you so you can start to apply it, start to benefit, start to sleep better. Of course, this is all for educational purposes only, but nonetheless, here's the shared experience. And this is mega important because despite people having a lot of great results, there are still people who find some of the breathing exercises too complicated or they just hit a wall. Nonetheless, what you got to focus in on here is improving CO2 tolerance, because when you do that, it'll help reset your breathing thermostat, which helps you breathe better at night. So how you do it, and this is actually from free diving, is that you first wanna find how long can you comfortably hold your breath after an exhale. Here's the steps on that. If you need a reminder, you can look at that later. And effectively, you wanna start a little bit below this and then try to go above that. And all you do is you hold your breath after an exhale, and then you go through like a rest period where you just breathe normally for like 20 seconds or so, and you just do that. And then as time goes on, you increase this time, and that will be correlated to easier breathing at night. Follow for more sleep apnea insights, and then get the free guide at apneareset.com.